Hey BC's Crazy World, it's me. <laughs> um, <clears throat> let's see, where do I start? It's been a minute since I did an update, so I think I did the my hospital update, I think. Not 100%, but I think I did. If I remember correctly, I think I did. Well, I went to my doctor today, um, which is 2-5-2024. I went to him today. He referred me to my the migraine doctor that I seen a few years ago. I just haven't been back to him. So he referred me there. Uh he ref and he was gonna refer me to my foot doctor, which I already have an appointment with them on the twenty eighth. Of this month partially because my aunt has one too so we kind of scheduled them around the same time um, I also have a an appointment on the fourth of March and on the fifth of March now um, and whenever just a side or my Headache doctor calls me. I'll have an appointment with him too coming up. The 4th or March 4th is my heart doctor. I'm just booked with appointments anymore. It's like I'm booked with all these appointments just because I'm trying to get my health under control, trying to get back on all my medicines, trying to make sure I get my body taken care of so I can live a lot more longer than. I need to or not die so my son will have uh, my son will have his mommy because I don't want to leave this world without my son um, knowing that I tried my darnest and I want him to see mommy's getting all the help she needs and and mommy's a fighter and not gonna give up so that's that's me and I'm gonna fight to a T I've been trying to change my ways apparently today my blood pressure was a little bit elevated again so and I know when I go back to my migraine doctor they'll probably put me on medicines medicines for that he'll put me on my headache medicine stuff like that so we're gonna get stuff squared away <laughs> um me and my boyfriend just went out this past weekend and we had an amazing time. We went to my great niece's birthday party, as you can tell with some of the past videos posted this morning. So I made sure I went ahead and posted some videos. I posted a lot of stuff this morning or last night, one of the two. I do have some hateful comments on some of my videos, but that's to be expected. Whatever. I don't care. I'm just making my viewers go up. Because this person was like, well, you're not capable of being a doggy owner. Well, my mom was just playing around, which she didn't bite my mom. She didn't bite anybody <clears throat> with the dog, our do one of our dogs. And this person had a fit about it because we were teaching her, unquote, unquote, to be mean. That's not what we were doing. We wasn't hitting her. We wasn't being mean to her. We wasn't hitting, or she was not hitting anybody. My mom was not hitting anybody or anything like that. We were just playing with her. She was being protective of my mom's boyfriend. So my dog does the same thing. If something doesn't go her way or if I get onto my son, he does, she does the same thing to me. Or vice versa, she'll get, she'll do the same thing to Junior. She doesn't bite. She doesn't hurt us. No. She'll bark at us and be like, no, don't do that. She just kind of, hey, no, no, no. But we're not hurting our dogs. We're not hurting our animals. Our animals are safe. Our animals are taken care of, fed like they should be. If you see in some of my past videos, one of the cats, it was fixed. Um... You can tell she eats a lot. Um, yeah. So. 
Don't tell us how to run our animals. Our animals are just fine. Um, I have also been having some mental health or mental health going on to the point where it's fucking with my depression, my anxiety. There's some other things fucking with my depression and my anxiety. Excuse my language. Messing with my anxiety and depression to the point makes me think of the worst things possible or make me think bad about myself. So there is that. I barely have people I can talk to, which sucks. Like, I love my family to death. Don't get me wrong. I love my boyfriend to death, but I'm shutting down. I barely have anybody to talk to, and I don't want to talk to people for some reason. And it's building up and building up and building up. And I'm, I feel that I'm going to have one of my worst outbursts to the point where I'm not going to want to do anything. I'm just going to want to cry and scream and yell. But I am trying so hard to be strong, think positive, and everything. It's just hard. So, I don't know. If you have any thoughts on anything I can do, like I've tried writing, I've tried drawing, I've tried tried to open up to my boyfriend about it. We've been together for a year. As past um, 28th of January, we've been together for a year. We have some stuff we are having some trouble with. So yeah, we are having a little bit of relationship issues, but we're both we are, we're working on it. It's, we're working on it. And it's not that we argue. It's not that we fight. It's not that we have anything we're hiding from each other because that's not it at all. We just have a lot of stuff going on. (laughs) That is for me and him to know. No one else needs to know. No one else needs to be in our business at all it's not anybody else's business besides ours so but that's about it that's my update thank you for watching bye